My project is on the four poster Arcara side applicator. The purpose of this is to display what the most cost effective approach to tick control in a deer population might be. The three options that I looked at were capturing each deer and applying an acaricide, setting up something that automatically applies the acaricide, or something, or just allowing the ticks to spread. So the only one here that would be cost effective would be the second option. In this realm, we have the four poster Arcarisade applicator, which is essentially a food trough which lures deer to itself and uses the paint rollers that you can see on the right to apply the Acaricide to the deer's ears, neck, and head. This is needed because Lyme disease has been reported in most states and white-tailed deer are the main host of several species of ticks. The life of the tick is displayed on the right. Here we can see that an acaricide applicator would target ticks at both the nymphal stage and the adult stage. In the paper I read by Danicola, from 1999 to 2003, there was a 70.2% reduction in the nymphal tick population using the four-poster acaricide applicator. Twenty-three four-posters were put at 23 residential sites in the town of Old Lyme, Connecticut. This treatment site covered approximately 576 hectares. The main sampling method in these papers is known as tick dragging. In tick dragging, a 1 by 1 meter corduroy cloth is attached to one side of a wooden dowel. This cloth is dragged over vegetation as shown on the right where ticks may be perched. The cloth simulates a deer or other mammal that is passing by which causes the ticks to release their post on the vegetation and grab onto the cloth. Once they're on the cloth, researchers can count how many ticks are on the cloth and what species they are. One of the papers I read used small mammal traps to capture rodents. These rodents were anesthetized and examined for ticks. This figure displays something I don't really understand. This figure on the right displays the number of ticks in relation to the distance from the four post acaricide applicator. The abundance of the nymphs is shown on top and the adults is shown on the bottom. So we can see that the abundance of ticks increases with distance from the acaricide applicators. These are the sources that I recommend consulting if you want to know more about a caricide application via a four-poster. Thank you.